What are the few faults of UV printers that we can solve quickly by ourselves? The Color Print Technology Co. LTD. UV printers have a wide range of applications and powerful functions and are very simple to operate. However, with the use of time, there will be some simple system failures, which I can solve by myself. Through the information feedback and market research of many users, McCuller Print Printers have summarized. UV printers have a wide range of applications and powerful functions and are very simple to operate. However, with the use of time, there will be some simple system failures, which I can solve by myself. Through the information feedback and market research of many users, McCuller Print Printers have summarized some faults that users can solve by themselves for your reference. 1. If the step test function of the UV flatbed printer fails, where should it be solved? In this case, the first step is to ensure that the voltage of the interface board is maintained at the normal value, the adjustment is stable, and there is no voltage instability. Then, the voltage of the stepper driver is adjusted to maintain stability. Then, connect the pulse signal line correctly. 2. The head of the flatbed printer is blocked and cannot print normally. Where should I solve it? When this happens, the heads must be squeezed and cleaned first. After the cleaning is completed, test and check. Please pay attention to the correct cleaning steps of the head, cleaning and maintenance method of the UV printer head. If there is still a single head that cannot work, it is necessary to check whether the head plate is faulty. If there are still multiple or all heads that cannot work, then we need to check the color separation plate and replace it. 3. The UV flatbed printer cannot be accurately positioned, and where should the frequent printing errors be solved? When this happens, we need to check whether the 15-core wire and the interface card are damaged. If they are damaged, replace them in time. 4. Where should the flatbed printer suddenly stop working or have a wrong positioning, and where should the faults, such as uncontrolled ink output from the head, be solved? In these cases, we need to reinstall the PCI card, and if it still doesn't work, replace it with a new PCI card. We also need to check the connection of the 37-core wire and the 68-core wire to see if it is disconnected or damaged, and reconnect it in time or replace it with new parts. 5. Where should the front of the UV printer collide with the printing material? When there is a quick emergency stop and the front of the character car hits, you need to readjust the height of the front of the car. Before adjusting, you must calculate how high it is and then adjust it. Then turn on the anti-collision setting of the front of the car, move the front of the car back to the initial position, close the operating software, turn off the computer and the tablet UV printer, and turn it on again after a while. Ease. Ten. Six. When the UV flatbed printer is used, it suddenly prompts that the port cannot be queried. Where should I solve it? When the port cannot be found, we need to enter the printer operating software printing system to manually add the port. The specific operation is, find the management item, select set port, click set user port, and click add port. 7. After the flatbed printer is connected to the computer, it cannot receive data normally and respond accordingly. What should I do? In this case, we need to reinstall the PCI card and interface board. If the PCI and interface board are damaged, please replace them with new parts. After the reinstallation is complete, restart the computer and send the command again to detect the data transmission operation. In order to reduce the delay in encountering the above failures during the use of the machine, we need to keep some vulnerable parts such as interface cards, PCI cards, and various data transmission lines that need to be replaced when using the flatbed printer to be replaced at any time in case of problems. Once the above problems occur, immediately check and reinstall or replace to solve the problem and save our time. If you can't solve it yourself, you need to ask the manufacturer's technicians for help.